Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to what's sure to be an out-of-control Raw, coming off an epic Royal Rumble. Epic doesn't even begin to describe it, Michael. Rey Mysterio shocked the world by winning the Royal Rumble match again. Meanwhile, we have a new United States champion in Chris Jericho. Against all odds, and with his job on the line, Chris Jericho triumphed. I'm sure that's not going to sit well with either Raw General Manager Stephanie McMahon, Big Show, or former champ Kofi Kingston. That's not a very good list of people to tick off. I see some repercussions in Jericho's future. Chris, have you seen Hornswoggle around? Tiny green guy, has a hat. Not since he magically conjured my cereal at breakfast, no. But I'll tell him you were looking for him if I find his secret rainbow lair. No, don't do that. Don't tell him I'm looking for him. Just come get me and tell me where he is. I really can't imagine having the interest or the free time to do any of that, but crazier things have happened. Don't worry, DMV. I'm not here to fight you. But I'm sure you have been put on the notice that Santino is no longer losing, like a loser loses. So when I have you out and down tonight, you have no need to be shamed. You are just another feather in Santino's winning cap. Man, you have got to be the least intimidating man I have ever seen. You look like a squirrel. You act like a squirrel, and I think you're speaking in squirrel. Do not make light of the mighty squirrel, MNOP. This squirrel, he is the winner, squirrel. At Royal Rumble, as they often are, I had the odds against me. My career, my livelihood, was on the line. But once again, Chris Jericho overcame the obstacles and proved, once and for all, why I am the best in the world at what I do. And I'm wearing gold to prove it. What can I say? I'm a title belt magnet. And I'm prepared to attract yet another championship. Triple H, I'm coming for you. And when... Get lost. I'll give you an autograph later. Triple H, the game. I'm completely focused on you. Huh? You have bigger worries than Triple H. A week ago, you robbed me of becoming WWE Champion. Tonight, I get my revenge when I snap you in half. This isn't about championships. It's about my vengeance. Well, it's... It's your funeral, Big Show. Scheduled for one fall. In 
Introducing first, standing at seven feet tall, weighing 441 pounds, The Big Show. Ferocious clothesline, just devastating. You hear how his leg connected? And he lights up his chest with a chop. Jericho controlling the head. Oh, that head's got to be screaming. We should probably remind everyone that this is a non-title match. Like Big Show said earlier, this isn't about championships. It's about revenge. Jericho's trying. Jericho's looking to put him in the walls. It's the walls of Jericho. Jericho wasn't going to just lay down and let Big Show dominate him. There's a reason he's been a multi-time world champion, Michael. Simple. As the stronger man, he has to bring his power into this one now and make it a factor. Ow! What an elbow! He does it again! He's looking to put his opponent away right here! Code breaker. Jericho hits the code breaker. There's the pin! Can his one, opponent kick out? Two, three! Jericho wins! Jericho wins! Chris Jericho once again escapes Cirque Du. He should market his own brand of rabbit's feet. He'd make a fortune. It appears Jericho is now clear to target Triple H, just like he alluded to earlier. This victory had to boost Chris's confidence, but he hasn't beaten Triple H one-on-one -on -one in a long time.